Uh, truth is stranger than fiction. So, <laughs> Saturday went to, to actually went to, to Duffy's Diner down in New Iberia. Oh, my goodness. I used to go to Duffy's all the time when I li- lived down there. Had some fried chicken. It's good fried chicken. They have good chili dogs. Of course, if you want a wiener, that's a different story. Yeah. But so after lunch, we were, I mean, we were full. We ate the sod. I mean, we ate a lot. And there's, there was we four had of fried us. chicken. And we had fried chicken. And it was good homemade hot fried chicken anyway. Do you have room for dessert? And of course, we're all stuffed. Like, this is like, oh, no. And then it was, what about a slice of hot apple pie with some ice cream? And I'm like, well, or maybe a milkshake. Yeah, well, I could, a probably, I could probably find a way to get a little <laughs> bit of chocolate malt in me at this point. And then I hear, what about a slice of apple pie with some cheese on it? And after I went to the bathroom and came back because it made me sick, <laughs> I, I just don't get it. I just have trouble. Like, I know I don't like cheese. Okay, so. well, but let, me, let me explain something to you. Okay, so when I was a... a oh, I'm getting something explained to me. Go ahead. Well, no, no. So, sometimes I think when you picture cheese, you picture like a big chunk of Velveeta or that... Or that comes out of a of, of a little wrapper, American processed cheese. I think the cheese that that I know my mom used to like the the sharp cheddar crumbled on it, and it was that sweet salty combo. You know the sweet salty, and and I know you like sweet salty combo. Yes. But but that was the it was that salty crumbly cheddar on melted on top of yeah. I I, I personally not a big fan, but I know my mom grew up. With a little little bit of cheese. Not a big chunk of Velveeta. Not melted like well, nachos. That's not even cheese. That's well, melted no, tires. But, but I mean, I, I don't you know that. what you're picturing there. Dyed orange. But <laughs> no, I just, any, any, I like the idea of it to me. And yes, I do like sweet and salty, like chocolate yeah. covered nuts or whatever. Yes, I do. There's just something about this that's, there's a sourness or something with cheese and the sweetness. And I, I, I don't know. I mean, I know the whole Asian food is based on sweet and sour, so maybe. Maybe I'm missing the boat here. It just seems like such a such an awful idea to begin with. Where did this come from, anyway? Well, it originally came from England, and then in New England, Midwest is, is where a lot of people. Uh, let's see, 45 percent in a very small, unscientific poll that was done elsewhere. 45 percent of responders said that they had never had cheddar on their apple pie and never would. But about 20 percent said they love it, and 30 percent said they would be curious. To try it, are we going to post something? See what people did. think. Okay. While you were typing, I was gagging over here, posted yes. a picture <laughs> of some cheese and an apple pie, and we just posted it on the Big One Hundred Two Point One Facebook page. The only good thing that could come from the idea of cheese on apple pie is this. Oh goodness! This is it. Cheese on apple pie. If you do it, can you tell me for God's sake why? Yes. You close me out, I ain't gonna lie. Blech. Cheese on apple pie. <laughs> The Big Morning Show with Fast and Renee, only on Big 102.1.